when you talk about America's needs, you have to talk first about our open border. I've been, I believe, in uh, maybe 20 something states over the last several weeks, going around the country, uh, appearing at events with my colleagues, and we're hearing from the American people of all parties and all persuasions and all cities and all states who feel this acutely, they understand the catastrophe at the border is affecting everyone. And it is top of mind for all the American people for that reason. So I brought that issue up repeatedly today in that room and, and again one-on-one -on -one with the President. I think that's our responsibility uh, to bring that up. The other big priority for our country, of course, is the funding of our government. And we have been working in good faith around the clock every single day for months and, and weeks and over the last several days quite literally around the clock to get that job done. We're very optimistic. I, I hope that the other leaders came out here and told you the same. We believe that we can get to agreement on these issues and prevent a government shutdown, and that's our first uh, responsibility. Uh, you also heard, I'm sure, that there was um, discussion about the supplemental uh, spending package, and uh, I was very clear with the President and all those in the room that the House is actively uh, pursuing and uh, investigating all the various options on that and we will address that in a timely manner. But again, the first priority of the country is our border and making sure it's secure. I, I believe the president can take executive authority right now today to change that. And I told him that again today in person, as, as I've said to him many times, publicly and privately over the last several weeks. It's time for action. It is a catastrophe and it must stop. And we will get the government funded and we'll keep working on that. So we'll have more for you soon.